What's going on guys? It's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video and today I will run you guys through exactly how you get the Year 3 Galahorn, giving you the location of all seven medallions as well. But before we get into the video, if this video does help you out, if you could leave a like, I would appreciate the support. If we could get 5,000 likes, that would be epic. Okay, so getting into it. To trigger the quest to get the Year 3 Galahorn, first you need to complete the Rise of Iron campaign. You'll then be prompt with a continuation of the quest, which when completed opens up the Galahorn quest. So the next step you must do to actually open up the Galahorn quest is called Patrol the Plaguelands, where you have to complete an anomaly scan near Arkans Keep. So basically fly to the Plaguelands and follow the waypoint I take and make your way to Arkans Keep. Once here, you need to look out for the patrol mission with this icon. This is basically what you need. If it isn't here, you're probably best going back to orbit, flying back down to the Plaguelands and coming back here. That's what I had to do the first time. So pick up the mission and follow the waypoint. This anomaly scan mission will lead you to a walker tank, but before you get there you'll come across a room which to get through, because there's lasers there, you'll need a splicer key. Now if you don't have a splicer key, you can obtain one by killing a brood mother or brood enforcer anywhere on the Plaguelands. It leads you to a walker tank where the thing you have to scan is behind this monster. So you can either do two things, you can either take out the walker tank then scan the thing behind him or you can take the cheap way out like I did and go invisible on your hunter. So once scanned, you have opened up a quest called Beauty in Destruction. So first things first, you'll have to talk to Saladin and Tyra at Falwinter Peak. You'll then be prompted with a quest to collect 7 medallions. Arkans Keep Medallion, Lord's Watch, Bonker Triglav, Giant's Husk, Forgotten Pass, Site 6 and Falwinter Peak. Ok so on screen now I will show you the location of all 7 and I'll catch you when it's done. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, so once you've collected all seven medallions, you'll then have to talk to Tyra at Fell Winter Peak, who prompts you to complete a mission, a symbol of honor. Now, solo in this mission can be a pain in the ass, so if you can get help, get it. You'll basically have to defend two points on the PvP map Bannerfall, and then you'll have to fight the boss of the mission, Lixis Light Stalker. Once done, you'll then have to return to Falwinter Peak and talk to Tyra and Saladin again. And then the final part of the quest for this Galahorn is to complete the mission Beauty in Delivery. Again, if you can get help, get it, because this mission can be a fuckfest of restarts. So basically, you'll have to clear out a shit ton of ads. Then you'll have to protect your ghost while he rebuilds your galley. And you are literally bombarded by Fallen, I mean hundreds. It is super fun to try and solo like I did, but it's a lot easier if you get a fire team. Once your Galahorn is completed, you get to test it out against two Splicer Walkers, which you have to kill to complete the mission. And from there, you have another chat with Saladin at Valwinter Peak, and your galley quest is done. And you now own the Year 3 Galahorn. And that's basically it guys, that's how you get the Galahorn Year 3. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, hope it helped out. If it did, do drop a like, I do appreciate the support. Subscribe to Daily Destiny, turn on notifications so you don't miss a thing. And I'll catch you guys on that next one. Peace out until next time. Peace! Use it well.